welcome back so in this video I'm gonna see if we are able to log into route 53 how does it work and possibly buy a domain so let's find out where the route 53 is and it should be somewhere in the networking I believe so IAT Greengrass security media can find it migration analytics government s3 oh wow i can't find it some of you will be yelling at me hey it's right there you just missed it okay so right 53 right there we gonna click on that so it's uh, it's it is again uh, um, it's it is uh, inside uh, networking and content delivery all right so this is the route 53 dashboard create hosted zone dns management so management would be where you go and uh, i believe uh, where you will put the a record c name and all that uh, Attack. so let's go back to the previous screen and we're gonna try to see registered domain so from within here it tells you what will be the charge to register a domain there are different domains that you can buy through um, AWS and there are tons of tons Wow look at that the whole list okay so let's try uh, trial and error trial and error see if this domain is available or not actually it's not advanced advanced trial and error is available and uh, well, let's let me go do a quick search if uh, uh, the domain bought through Amazon D uh, AWS AWS is uh, by default is it uh, private or public so let me find out all right so I found this information uh, even might be let me put it over here then yep yeah, so privacy is the uh, by default it's on so mm, ah okay interesting I just learned something new uh, I was looking for a domain and that domain was under this uh, I don't know it's how, how to pronounce it but uh, but that uh, and I was you know I wasn't sure what it is I did find that it was uh, a French company so AWS then all right so just like Google domains uh, the uh, yeah, route 53 does uh, register your domain with privacy protection enabled so let's go and try to find a domain for ourselves <coughs> mm, let me think about it all right so let's do this um, I'm gonna see if this domain is available or not that is available so I'm gonna go put that to add card I'm gonna go for one year now for now uh, view pricing details for route 53 uh, you pay a monthly charge for each hosted zone manage so if you host a zone uh, you will pay serving DNS query you, you incur charges for every DNS query answered by the Amazon user allays a direct map to elastic load balancing instances Okay, curious. So, uh, alias queries. This is the most important one. Why did no additional cost?
I can always scrap that uh, but uh, for the health checks health checks to count uh, per month and month per optional per optional feature 53 resolver So um, we'll see what happens. <clears throat> so I'm gonna go and uh, continue to for this domain. So continue. This is the registration information that uh, I can put in uh, on camera. But before I go ahead and fill this out, let's create an S3 bucket. Cause uh, in the, in the I, I actually, you know, uh, Close that page but it said something to point to a uh, s3 so what I want to see in action uh, if I uh, type in this domain and it takes me to that s3 bucket so we'll do some DNSing so let's go and uh, create the uh, first click here then create s3 have a link I'm gonna get the aslan yes down here. Let's put the whole copy link. Let's see if I can put the domain name as a uh, bucket name. US Virginia choose no not choosing. We are creating so I'm gonna because we are uh, putting it um, like uh, uh, website so I'm gonna not uh, I'm gonna allow public access bucket versioning we're gonna disable add tags server side encryption advanced setting do we need anything in advance object lock create bucket let's see if it allows me oh I have that bucket now uh, islandahir.com all right so we're gonna do the same thing that we did here but before that let me pause the video here and go ahead and fill this out so I can show you here saying thank you for uh, registering your domain with us and order submitted successfully and uh, it's just waiting um, oh it uh, never asked me for me payment information but I believe it's going through automatically uh, on the cardon file I'm gonna close it and wait for that email all right so let's go and close this and go to domains so you can see the domain name registration is in progress I'm gonna uh, pause the video here and see how long it takes uh, maybe in 10 minutes I will come back and see so I have received the registration sign up email I clicked on that link I'm gonna refresh it then nothing in pending it means it uh, went live so auto renew uh, status there should be a transfer lock I should put one here but anyways so this one uh, is live I'm gonna pause the video here and see what's inside all right so inside there was all the personal information that I chose not to put on uh, uh, the camera now we're back to our main we want to connect uh, to the uh, bucket, but I'm gonna wrap this video here. It's already nine minutes mark. So if this video of registering the domain through uh, Router 3 has helped you Please rate comment subscribe and share in the next video. We will connect our domain to our bucket and see how uh, our static website works <clears throat>